When I was 16, I was fortunate to win a scholarship to Antarctica, and that for me instilled the sense of adventure and responsibility towards working on this global problem. When I was much younger, I wanted to be a scientist and engineer. My curiosity has always drived me to explore and learn about new things. Seabound is a climate tech startup based in London that builds carbon capture equipment specifically for ships. Our goal is to decarbonize the shipping industry, and we do that by installing carbon capture equipment onto big container ships and cargo ships. Shipping is an essential sector. It accounts for 90% of global trade. There's no way to clean up ships' emissions at the moment. The value of technology as a tool to augment your way of thinking. It allows you to think beyond what you can immediately see or touch or feel. And so technology is absolutely critical for cleaning up shipping. So my ThinkPad X1 Yoga has been powering my work in a variety of different ways. It's a very flexible and portable device. Some days I'm running around London meeting with investors and I can fold the device over and show them our pitch decks really easily. Or other days I'm working kind of heads down with our team and we can work on a lot of the designs and 3D models together. The ThinkPad X1 Carbon is very small and lightweight so I can carry it around anywhere I go. It is also very powerful so I can run simulations, data processing, and look at visualizations. So we started by building land-based prototypes of our technology, and now we're moving on to our next milestone, which is to put our prototype equipment on board a ship. This is something that's never been done before by us at Seabound, let alone by anyone in the world. So we're using a second-generation carbon capture technology called calcium looping. We use calcium oxide to capture CO2 on board ships, and we regenerate the material on land, turning it back to calcium oxide again. We only have about seven years to go to have global emissions. And so in my mind, I think technology is the only channel for change that can really move at that pace. We're two young, ambitious women who wanted to tackle a big global problem. We didn't necessarily have the perfect background. We're not shipping veterans. I think if you are curious about tackling the climate crisis and especially about building a climate tech startup, I would encourage you to go for it. That's what the world needs.